Hello fellow digital SAT studiers, we're going to go ahead and answer this question in a different way than what College Board provides, and in my opinion is easier. So we have x, x over y equals 4, we're going to go ahead and uh, cross multiply, so 4 times y equals x. Four. Okay, yellow was definitely the worst one to pick. 4 times y equals x. Now that we have that information, we can go ahead and plug in 4y for x over ny. Now that we have that, we can cancel out the y's. And now we have 24 times 4, which is 96. So that'll be 96 over n. And then don't forget, this equals 4. Set equal to 4. And just to write it out, we know that 4n equals 96, so you divide by 4 to get n equals 24, because 96 divided by 4 is 24. Now, if you already knew that using this, you could have just done 96 divided by 4 equals n, you know, 4 divided by n equals 96, or no, 4 times n equals 96, but at the same time, 96 divided by 4 equals n, you know, it's sort of a pyramid of relationships. That's about it. Um, again, this, in my opinion, is easier. Obviously, College Board says that, oh, you should do 24n times 4 equals 4, and then you multiply. But I just personally think, in my mind, this is easier. Um, if it helped, uh, click that like button. That's it. I uh, wish you luck on the digital SAT.